Catholics around the world are marking All Souls Day by visiting the graves of their dearly departed and praying for their souls. Our Vatican correspondent, Juliet Lindley, takes us to a little-known cemetery tucked away inside the Vatican. Dwarfed by the grandeur of St. Peter's Basilica and measuring just 100 by 60 feet, many visitors to Rome know nothing of this cemetery's existence. The Teutonic Cemetery is the oldest German establishment in Rome. Set at the foot of the Vatican walls, it's the burial ground for German Catholics with a deep connection to the Vatican. The cemetery today is a reminder for German Catholics of the strong ties and the long history between the Holy See and our country. When they come to Rome, many German pilgrims make a point of coming to the Vatican to visit the cemetery and pay their respects. The privilege of being buried here is generally reserved for members of an organization founded in the mid-15th century by German officials of the Roman Curia. Cardinal Joseph Ratzinger was its best-known member before becoming Pope. Something many people might not to be aware of is that Pope Emeritus Benedict, before he was elected Pope, used to celebrate Mass in the church by the cemetery every Thursday morning. Inside the church, which was renovated in the 1400s, the original altar, a stone slab, is still used to this day. In ancient Roman times, however, the spot where the cemetery now stands was known as Nero's Circus, a chariot racing ground. But as Catholics celebrate All Souls Day, it's poignant to remember that it was also the site where many of the first Christian martyrs gave their life for the faith. At the Vatican, Juliette Lindley, EWTN News Nightly.